This is James Mathers for the Digital Cinema Society at NAB 2024. I'm here with Barry Garcia in the Nanolite booth and he's going to tell us about their latest lights. What do we have here, Barry? So these are brand new lights. We just dropped them a couple of days ago. They're the Alien and uh, people are like, well, why are you calling it that? Pretty much look at the back of it. You can kind of tell it looks a little like an alien though with the eyes and the fans. So interesting name for something new. But what we really like about these new fixtures is that they are extremely bright. I mean, the output is amazing for them. We've got 150 watts. We also have a 300 watt. They're full RGBWW. So you've got a very large CCT range. But then we have that full RGB as well as some of the higher end uh, functions that you have on some of the Nanlux lines. So we're kind of being able to mixing a little bit of the two but we think people are really going to love these guys. And it uh, has full color control? Sure. So some of the things that we have, we've got the ability to be able to add some of the color. Let me spin it back around for you guys to see. Nice heavy-duty connectors on both sides. DMX, the power switch is up top, which makes it simple and easy to kind of turn on. And then you've got a large display screen, full color, that gives you, kind of tell you where you are in the different modes, as well as as you move around and you adjust what you might be doing. Same with the mode. We can move move through X and Ys, as well as some of the gels. And you choose which gel would work best for you, depending on what your, uh, your needs are. So that's what I like about them. Lead gels make it just easy, so you can do whatever you need to. All the usual ways to control the light, we've got DMX, we've got wireless TRMX, we've got the ability to use the Nanlink app, as well as everything that you can possibly need right there at your fingertips. And the cool thing about this light is the heads are IP55, so you can pour water all over them. We're also going to include a cover that allows you to cover these guys up if you want to have it close to the fixture, or if you want to, we've got an extension cable that'll be able to take the, the controller away and you can still have the head out in the weather, so to speak. So even though it's a very rugged head, it probably doesn't weigh very much because the control's down in the separate box. Yes, sir. I really and truly, um, the little guy on the 150, you're looking roughly around five or six pounds. The bigger guy on the 300, probably about seven, eight pounds or so. So it's really mountable and able to get up in there. And like I said, since it's as bright as it is, you're really getting a lot of output for what you're looking for. This all works with the Nanlite app? Yes, sir. Yeah, I always be able to do our Nanlink app and be able to do what it is for if you're putting it way up in the air, or if you've just got it around the corner and you're trying to get your lights together. That ability is there for be able to do any type of control. I've been using that, it works great. Oh, I know, I love it. The new app, we, which we dropped in February, uh, updated, really made some big, strong improvements, and we're really excited about it. Thank you, Barry. It's always a pleasure, James, you know that.